TMZ.com. President Biden resumed what had been paused for a good while in D.C., namely, POTUS being in attendance for the Kennedy Center honors, and hosting them afterward. J.B. held a reception Sunday at the White House, with this year's recipients of the Lifetime Achievement Award being in attendance, front and center. Among those who were honored, Lorne Michaels, Bette Midler, Barry Gordy, Justino Diaz, and Joni Mitchell. Together at last. Your Kennedy Center honorees, starstruck, rainbow, two hearts. Watch December 22nd at 9-8C on at CBS and at Paramount Plus as we celebrate the 44th Hashtag KC Honors Class, Hashtag Justino Diaz, Hashtag Barry Gordy, Hashtag Lorne Michaels, at Bette Midler, and at Jonah Mitchell. Camera Scott Suchman slash CBS hash Kennedy Center Honors Pick. Twitter.com slash Kumpfjui. The Kennedy Center, at Kinson, December 5, 2021, at Kinson. There were a lot of other high profile people on hand as well including First Lady Jill Biden, VP Kamala Harris, Speaker Nancy Pelosi, Steve Martin, David Letterman and others. Biden, who was suited and booted in a tux, delivered some remarks, highlighting each person's contribution via their art, going down the list one by one and singing their praises. He also shouted the late Stephen Sondheim, who recently passed away. President Biden delivers remarks at the Kennedy Center Honorees Reception. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash now 8 RZQ. Dr. Jeffrey Gutterman, at Jeffrey Gutterman, December 5, 2021 at Jeffrey Gutterman. Each honoree showed off their rainbow-colored ribbons that were placed around their necks, and they each stood when called upon. The whole reception lasted a little less than half an hour, but even so, it meant a lot to folks who hadn't seen this since 2016. President Trump snubbed the ceremony for the first three years in office and never hosted any of the recipients after threats of a boycott came down in 2017, his first year in office. Kennedy Center honorees at whpick.twitter.com slash z290 Craig Kaplan, at Craig Kaplan, December 6, 2021 at Craig Kaplan. Seems everyone was happy to get this going again in the presence of our Commander-in-Chief, 